guess what I'm going to do? I'm going to Floby. This is a Floby, and it's connected to a vacuum cleaner, <laughs> to the wall. All right, I'm going to show you what I do in between haircuts when I just want a little off. So I will demonstrate and then do a voiceover. All right, you ready? Look out. First of all, you find the little clips that go on. You find out how much hair you want to get off. Can you see? This one. Okay. So I hold it up here. I, I don't want that much off. So I will take another one of these little clips and go like this. There you go. I've done this for so long because I put it on. Oh, uh oh, one of those broke. This is how old this sucker is. <laughs> Part of that is broke off, but it'll still work. You ready? <laughs> Okay, here we go ladies. So the idea is to use it, you put it flat on your skull and you lift it up and down in sections. You take your time. Now I've done this for so long that, and my hair is fine that I know I can just do a sweeping motion. But I suggest you watch the video completely through any demos uh, more in depth than mine. Mine's just a quick one. But it's, it, it really works. And you want your hair to be clean and dry and uh, start with the longest attachments first so that less is more. You understand we took, too, we took way too much off to start with, so start at the longest. I don't know what I'm saying there. All right, the Floby comes with an oil as well that will keep your blade sharp. It's made in the USA. Now it's $259, but it will pay for itself in months, especially if you only use it for that. That's what my husband does. He does not go to a barber and then I clean up his neck. All right, now I'm gonna take off that attachment and put on a little bit shorter one. I think it, they come in like a quarter inch, half inch, one inch. So here we go, put now, I'm gonna go back over again because I want a little bit more off. Yeah, hold it flat, I said, against your skull, and take your time. <laughs> it works so much better if your hair is clean. If your hair is not clean, then it, you won't get an even cut. And it's, it's really safe. You're, if you follow the directions and don't put on too short of attachments, take your time, you're going to be pleased with it. Now, it's difficult to do by yourself for the back of your hair, but I have figured it out because I took our little attachments and there's enough of them that I did. My, my wedge right here, see, is measured for exactly how I want my hair. And then I put it right here above my ear, hold my ear, and then I go a few inches back and sweep down. See, so it's a little bit, it cuts less on the top and more on the bottom. If you want to practice on your cat, <laughs> not. And I'll show you what I do around the back. As I suggest, it'd be easier if you had someone to help you do the back. But since I've done this for so long, that I can know exactly where I place this wedge. Make sure you have it the right way with the longest part on the top. And I go to the base of my skull with the top of the floby, and I just go around like so. It, it, it just works fabulous. And then, as I said, my husband will clean up the back for me and uh, it's a voila. It is very, very easy. Okay, on we go. <laughs> See, I've done this so long that I know what I want for length in my hair, okay? My husband will cut around the back and shave my neck with a little shaver. That's it. I'll show you in a minute once I get it all fixed. Don't go anywhere. Okay. Here I am. My husband did as good a job as he can down there. And there it goes until I go in next time to get it fixed. And they don't even know that I've done this. Okay? Easy peasy. We have had ours forever in the 80s. And it's still working well. Like I said, it's kind of taped up and whatever. But when it finally dies, we will purchase another one because it's just perfect. It was great, especially during COVID. Love ya. Mwah.